Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will be showing you how can you play almost any game with any controller. So let's start. So basically, we have these two types of gamepad. The first one is Logitech FC10, which is a Logitech gamepad, and it almost acts like a Xbox 360 controller, so it supports all the game. But the second one is Logitech Rumble Pad 2 which doesn't support all the game. So in this video, I'll be telling you how can you play almost all types of game using these types of game pads by using software. So in the first step, you need to download the software called Xbox 360 Controller Emulator. For my system, I'm gonna download the 64-bit version and save it in the desktop. And once you have downloaded the zip file, you need to extract the zip file. So I'm gonna extract the file on my desktop and you will get this application just double click the application to open it and once you have opened the application it will ask you for creating a dll file so go ahead and create uh, that file after that it will search your first controller for my case i have two controllers i'm gonna quickly finish those and this is the second time you will ask for the second controller i'll finish that too and now Make sure all the buttons of your controller are responding to the same button on the Xbox 360 controller in this graphical image. For example, one should respond to X, 4 equal to Y, 3 equal to B, 2 equal to A and so on. But in case if one is not respond to X, you need to click on to the X button and click on record then press the one button. This will register the button. So once you are done with the settings, you need to click on save, then exit the application and you will get these two files to simply copy the files and you need to paste those files in the directory, the game directory where the exe or the application file is located. For my example, I'm going to go to jump force, then jump force again, then binaries, then win64 and as you guys can see, this is the exe or application file from the game, from where the game will launch. So I'm going to simply paste those files here. In this case, I'm going to skip it because I have already done that. But in your case, you have to paste those files here. Make sure to paste those files in the directory where the game exe file or the application file is located. Otherwise, the software will not work. And now we'll play Jump Force and test the controller settings. And my brother will be playing it for you. いや、ってみなきゃわかんねえさ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ。うわ